All right, artists, it is time to paint your ceramic tile. So you can put your design close by so you can refer to it while you work. And if you want to change the colors a little bit, that's okay, but you would have had to tell me that at the painting station. But I'm going to follow my design. So I think I'm going to start with the middle and kind of work my way out. So I'm going to start with the middle of my flower and do the orange. This medium-sized brush makes sense for me. So I'm just going to, I don't even need to get it wet. I just put it right in the paint and I'm gonna paint directly onto my tile. We wanna make sure we have enough paint on our brush to catch all those white spots. It really shouldn't look too dry when you're doing it. You should be able to, and you see how I'm just kind of going up and down like that? That's filling in the spaces. If it's looking dry like this, that means you need to get a little more paint on your brush. You really want to fill in all those white spaces. Okay, now when I want to change colors, I need to wash off my brush, obviously. So uh, when I wash my brush, I'm touching the bristles, those little hairs, I'm touching them to the bottom of my cup. So I can feel the bottom of my cup while I do this and I'm swirling it around and then I'm going to wipe off the extra water and I'm going to dry it on the paper towels. You want your paintbrush to be dry. If we water down this paint, it's going to make it really thin and then it's not gonna be good coverage on our tile. So you want the paintbrush to be quite dry when you go back to get your next color. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the yellow petals. So I'm loading my paintbrush up with paint and I'm just going for it. So take your time. If you have an oops, let's turn it into a beautiful oops. Remember you have different size brushes for a reason. So if you're doing something that's a really small detail, get a small brush. And if you're doing a larger area, use a larger brush. And you do need to turn it around a little bit. So turn it on its side if you're trying to get this part of your petal so you can see what you're doing. There really shouldn't be any white spots left on your tile when you're all done, unless that's part of your design. It should be purposeful. Okay, so take your time. Get all those white spots even off the sides. And have fun. <laughs> 